Okay everyone, so in this Shopify tutorial, how to add variants to your Shopify store in 2021. So we're gonna do this, we're gonna add size, color and material, but you can do other variants as well using this tutorial. So let's do this. Okay, so in your Shopify dashboard, go to the left sidebar to this one, products. Now locate the product you want to add variants on. I'm gonna choose this one. Just click on the product. Okay, so this is just an example product to demonstrate variants. We're gonna go down to this one, media. So we're gonna add variants for color with a white t-shirt and a red t-shirt. So I'm just gonna go and add a red t-shirt image. Go and click on this one, add media. And choose your image, click on open. And that's it. Now we're gonna go down to this one, variants. Check this box. And now this will open, options. We have option one, we have size. You can change this to color, material, style and title. I'm gonna choose size. And then we have this one, separate options with comma. So just do your options. I have small, comma, medium, comma. And to keep this demonstration short, I'm just gonna do small and medium. After that, we're gonna go and click on add another option. So for this one, we're gonna add a color. So I have white, separate with comma, and red, separate with comma, like that. We can also add another option. We can choose material, style, or title. I'm gonna choose material. So in this uh, t-shirt, you can choose between cotton and wool, like that. So when you are satisfied with your options, we can go down to preview. So now you see that we have different variants. We have small, white cotton, and the price, and quantity, and SKU. So SKU is a unique identifier. And the identifier needs to be numbers and letters. So let's say I have small white cotton. We can add S W C and maybe t-shirt 001. So whatever you like. And then you know that if you got this SKU that you need to uh, get this uh, variant. All right, I'm just gonna leave that as blank. So the price, we can add special price for each variant. So let's say wool is more expensive for me to buy uh, from the manufacturer. So I need to sell this at a $15 cost, like that. And also quantity, I have small white wool of a quantity of, let's say, 20 like that but to edit things faster we're just gonna go and save this in the top right corner and now we can see that we have these options we can choose all or we can choose some of them like that but we also have this one select so let's say i want to change the price for all the wool i can click on this uh, link wool text and now we can see that all the wool t-shirts are checked. Now we can go to more actions, click on edit prices and just add a price. So $15 for all of these wool t-shirts and click on apply to all. And now all of these wool t-shirts has a price of $15. Let's go and click on done. So then you will save a lot of time, okay? Same thing with uh, uh, the red t-shirts. We can click on red and all of the red t-shirts are selected. And now we can click on more actions, click on add images, and just add a red image. Go down and click on done. And now we can see that you have red t-shirt images on red color. So let's go and just do this for white. I'm gonna click on white, 
click on more actions, click on add images and choose white image. Click on done. Fast and easy. So now just go up to the top right corner, click on save. And we also have another option. If I click on this one, add variant, we have a more detailed view. So if I click on this one, small white cotton, we can see that we have this more in detailed uh, view for each variant. So now we can see our options in more detail for each variant. So we have size, color and material. We have pricing, inventory, shipping. Okay, so that's uh, nice to know if you want to have a nicer overview of each variant. I'm just gonna go and click on back to product. And I'm just gonna go and add uh, quantity to all of these. I'm just gonna click on more actions, click on quantities. And in my case, I'm gonna get 20 for all. I'm gonna click on apply to all, click on save. But in your case, it may be different quantities for each variant, all right? Let's go and click on preview. Okay, so now we have size, color and material. So let's choose a t-shirt. I'm gonna choose size medium. And now notice the image when I choose from color white to red. It changes the image because I changed color to red. So that's a nice feature. We have material cotton. Now look on the price when I change the material cotton to wool. It changes to 15. All right. Okay, everyone. So this is how you can add variants to your Shopify store. If you like this video, please check out my full Shopify playlist in the description below. And also check out my other videos. Have an awesome day. Take care and bye.